Hello everyone, it's Gen back with another Age of Pirates 2 City of Abandoned Ships video. Today we are going to continue. In this episode we're going to continue killing all these people. I shoot. I run for a while, I turn around and shoot again. And then I shoot again. And I'm not poisoned so it's fine, I'm just going to kill you. And to get your money, I don't know how they even have money. But they do so... yep. Come on guys, here, let's wait for our gun to reload. And once they're all reloaded, we're gonna kill everybody again. I'm gonna play safe because I am running out of uh, potions. So I must take minimal damage, as minimal as, as possible, you know. Okay, I can go now then. Oh my god, I almost dropped my phone. Oh, why is there a face? Oh, there are faces here. Shoot. Run. Shoot. What's the guy standing there? What's he doing? I'll just wait, bro, if you're not gonna come. Oh, I didn't mean to do that, I meant to yeah, speed up the time. His blood is splattering all over the place. What is going on? It's like when you hit someone, the blood just uh, spurts out from his neck all the way up. And because those are one over here. It's when a lot of your arteries are um, located at. That's how they trans uh, your body transports blood to your brain, and yeah. I mean, there's general knowledge, and anyone should know this, so I don't know, I don't even know why I'm even explaining that, and, whoa, okay, so, a minute, okay, shoot, you're dead, shoot, you're not dead, but almost, frick, what, no, why are you, are you joking? How is he not dead? No, what? How are they both not dead? I oh my god, my luck was just so bad. I'm just gonna wait for the last bullet to be reloaded and then we're gonna go kill more. Okay, there we go. Now we're gonna go kill more of them. More Makohuitls. How is he not dead? Now oh, he's dead. Oh my god, the bodies are stacked together.
Let's just wait for our bullets to be reloaded. Alright, there we go. Are you seriously kidding me? Oh, I shot the same guy twice. No! No. There we go. Now let's loot the chest. Joking, we cannot. Oh my. How many potions do we. Okay. Alright, now I need to give you more stuff. <laughs> He's already full. Already full, sorry, that's bad pronunciation, but wow. Yes, I got personal abilities. I missed what the hell? How is he still alive? Okay, looks like we are done with reloading. Let's go kill more people right now. I didn't mean to. Okay, whatever. I shouldn't have used my potion. I was, it was instinctual to uh, use it. It's more like habitual actually. What the hell are you doing, my friend? You just die. Die, 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 die. Alright. Shoot. Shoot. Run. Shoot. I mean, pulls. I can't 
kick them. Also, since we have a personal ability, let's use it on Berserk. I guess we can. Oh, wait, actually, let's take the uh, this. I don't care about the rest anymore, who cares? I think they should remain. The loot will stay there, so it's fine. You can always come back another time. Excuse me, but I'm very late. Um, sale of health has gotten worse. Let's save the game. Okay. No, no, I can't run anymore because my health is worse. Greetings and salutations, Captain. Now, what can I do for you? Sell the diamond, the ruby, gold ingots, seven gold emerald rings, six sapphire gold sapphire rings, three big pearls, ten small pearls, five cameos, six golden brooches, three emerald pendants. Why not all because this gives you stealth bullets, please? Why do I have a pipe? Let's sell the pipe. Ten images of the Jaguar Warrior. Jaguar Warrior. I think about one. Let's give you one. A little Beretta pistol. Sell it. I'm not gonna sell the Jade Skull, of course. This guy has a lot of good stuff. This this merchant. I'm gonna keep that. Okay, a till. Saber. Do suck. Spanish rapier. Makwakwitl. And now, even more stuff to sell here. Why does he have so many bullets? Oh, no bullets, sorry. Why do I have so little bullets? I expected uh, him to have more. I have those items, that's fine, you can sell all because it's of no use for him. Which army pairs? Okay, wait, let's see. No, they both don't have. Okay. Go Dirk and give them to officers.
I didn't mean to do that. Let's go to Cayman again. Oh god damn it, there's a, there's a Dutch fleet behind us. Dutch fleet astern. Okay, now let's... Uh, <coughs> I didn't do that, sorry about that as well. Okay, we must be here. Let's check again, shall we? He said that it is too big to be to go unnoticed, but I really can't see anything. We really have to use cheats to find out where exactly it is. Cause I can't find it. I can't see it at all. It's not here, let's try Turks. I see a Fucking pirates. Ha, <laughs> sloop. What the hell? No. Oh, that's improved, yay. It's a little bit more eastward. No, the ram has been trunk. Okay, so it should be in a cave. In the cave, sorry. So... We shall look for the cave. Oh, it's right here. I'm blind. I was blind. Oh my god. What was I thinking? What was I doing? I'm an idiot. I'm a freaking bloody idiot. So now we're going to continue with our mission. Okay. Let's sail southward. Let's save the game. Of course, we have tablets. Tablets. Stone tablets with runic letters. And then we just sail to Guadalupe, which is right there. Mm. 
nasty pirates. Alright, where are I forgot to replenish our rum but our rum supply but our sailors seem to still love us so okay. Let's go to Morn how to pronounce this, whatever it is, shore. I also got a Lupe Bisateri port dot oh, the, 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 the bug is back. Okay, let's get to Bisateri port. Hey, you! Yeah. Oh my god, the yes, sea dogs as cannoneers. The best goods for mere pennies. Yes, nothing. Uh, so you have at least some tanks. Okay. Okay, thank you for your rum. Now let's go to the tavern so we can easily get to S gold. You can't even find a warm bottle of vodka in this hole. Oh, hole! You found something. I can see it in your eyes. I know that twinkle. Good lord, did I ever you use them to try to enter the tomb? If all of this comes to nothing, you do realize that I'm going to kill you, right? Alright, let's go to the tomb. Save game. Again. Here it comes guys, here it comes. And look. What is this? What is this? What is this? It's a sword. X looks very ancient. I found it for this item. It's a tomb. And yes, we have opened the... Uh, Thingy. Hell am I going? Hey, you! Yeah, you! I don't know you! And, um, I think there's gonna be a bug later, but we, we shall see. One. Okay, so, Eskol's residence... Ah, ah, here you are, Sir Peter Blood. So out with it, what did you find? I f so I found the entrance to a cave. There were a few tunnels to explore, and in one of them, well, there it was. The entrance, I found it. 
Oh my giddy aunt, a thousand devils, what was inside? In the middle was a stone sarcophagus, sarcophagus covered by a messes, massive slab. I couldn't shift the slab on my own. I wasn't equipped for it. Mm, so no treasure, no burial trinkets or nothing? Nothing to speak of, uh, nothing, nothing to speak of no. Mm, so everything must be with the body. Listen, here is a crowbar. How big is the slab? Will that be enough to shift it? Y you know, I... I'm not so sure how thrilled I am to bother the poor man's sleep, however happy he might be. You can't be serious, Captain. By now he'll be nothing but crumbling bones. This is a first. A pirate afraid of a little corpse. No, that's not it. I fear nothing. Uh, it's just that... Well, how would you feel some stranger pawing through your remains? Look, are you with me or not? Hey, I've come this far, haven't I? I'm deadly curious myself. Splendid. Take your crowbar, and I'll be here waiting impatiently. I have no doubt, Askold. Wonderful. So now we have um, a, 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 a crowbar for household use. Though you can't turn the world with it, you can put some heavy objects using the sharp pointed end. So you were just leaving. a bit more. Uh, uh, where is it? Yes, some potions, I need them. Okay, so this is where we save the game because we might die. I can use this as a choke point. Oh my god. Okay, wait. Come oh, here. that saved me. If managed my okay wait, let's uh let's do this again. Okay so um now this is where the bad thing happens. So we lose our patent after the after we switch bodies with the guy and um our title of Komoro will disappear, but at least our title, I mean, our rank of Komoro disappears, but at least our title remains. That's sad, because I worked quite hard for the Komoro title. Berserk, I think it's Berserk. It is done. I have risen from the dead. 
you've managed my servants. That's good. We, uh, what, and now tell me, what year is it? 1670. Christing infernos, what's happening? Now, the following is happening. We are talking. And a great event has already happened, which I have awaited for 600 years. I have risen from my sleep. Damn. And it looks like I woke you. What are you called and who are you? I'm Sir and you will live. My name is Sir Peter Blood. I'm privateer. If I do this, I think he will just kill me. He will just fight me. And he's immortal, so yeah. Privateer, explain. A privateer is a corsair. A filibuster, well, a pirate. Filibuster, pirate, well, how can I p explain it? Uh, I'm a free seaman and a free warrior. I have my own ship and do what I consider to be needed. Oho, so you and I are blood brothers. I'm happy that my plan was brought into being by your fellow soul. This is sign of great luck for me. What plan? What plan? Ha ha ha. You are talking to a person who died six, more than 600 years ago. That was what my plan is about. It means the message to my descendants have been found. Wait, what? Who are you? My name is Leif Erikson. I, like you, and a seaman, am a seaman and a warrior. I am my own boss. Only the I wandered was only I wandered. Only the place I wandered was somewhat north of here. When I was coming here, I heard that Leif the Lucky was buried here. The what? <laughs> the sudden change in music. That's you, I take it. Yes, I am Leif the Lucky, son of Eric the Red, ancestor of the ancient Kim Simbrians, Vikings, and Yorsal Yorsalif Yorsalir's Fari. So you're a Viking from a nation of barbarians that raided Europe 600 years ago. The Vikings aren't a nation, of course, eh? Yep. So once again, people come into my room, and then the whoa. Very freaking awesome. Anyways, uh, Viking is a way of life, the profession of a seaman and warrior. And you, libertine warrior, you call us barbarians? 600 years heather, we were the greatest warriors and seamen on the face of this earth. I've been to Lor Saler and marched on Rome, and my brother, why, you Gandariki. That's great, but how did you get here? Columbus only discovered America 150 years ago. Ho ho ho, is that what you call this land? America? Listen to me, wanton corsair. In your year, in our year, 986, Viking Bjarni Harry Olfson was on a routine voyage to Greenland when he was blown off course. Off his bow, he saw a land of trees, a new and unexplored heaven, haven. But winter approached, so he changed course, uh, course and never set foot on its soil. Fourteen years thence, I set off to find this land, and find it I did. I discovered the nobly plains of Heluland, the forests of Markland, and finally the wealth of Vinland. It is there, amidst the rolling hills, that I founded my settlement. Some years later, I travelled on to warmer and warmer climates, and ultimately to this endless domain. I docked much further to the north. Six hundred years ago? No, that can't be right. By your reckoning, it was in 1002 AD that I claimed this land. I penetrated deeply and found a land of no borders inhabited by the red Skrellings. Skre- what? You mean the Indians? No, I never encountered that tribe. But I lived twenty years with the Toltecs, who worshipped me as a god. When I had my fill, I returned to my settlement in Vinland, and there was- and there left a will to my progeny- progeny. Six hundred years later, it was carried out by you. Great. Is that all, then? Don't rush me. First, I shall make you a worthy present that will help set you free. Nothing like a practical gift, I always say, but what do you mean exactly? Your life. As a show of gratitude to you, I grant you your life. Oh, yes, that's nice to have. 
Well, thanks for the lovely conversation and all. I said don't rush. In, ex in return for this gift, I would like some favours of you. Aha! What do you have in mind? I feel that a big city is nearby. Most important man in the city has all the items I need. I feel his presence. You must bring me three crystal Toltec skulls of white, pink, and blue, and also an ancient object. You will know it as a strange thing. Then I will regain my power and may become bodily once more. The world awaits its master. Yeah, right. Uh, that's lovely. Can I go now? Go. Before you go, however, I take one more liberty of you. As insurance, you understand? For the moment, I shall take your body and you shall take mine. I am sure this will put speed in your sails. Wait, what? And now you can launch the F2 menu and he has become you and you, has become, you have become him. Now everything is in order. Are you ready to fulfill your destiny? What have you done? Listen, Leif friggin' Ericsson. The world's changed a lot since your day. There are a whole lot of white people around here. Now. Yeah? Whatever. Look, this isn't helping. The city there, it's not Holtec. You know, it's not Aztec. It's French. Do you know anything about modern civilization? I can't go around looking like this. A and you need not. All you need to do is capture this city. To that end, I lend you my servant, number enough to give you your way. And then, a bunch of skeletons are here for you. You have become Leif Erikson. Mm, yeah, we have lost our patent, we have lost everything. actually lost Where the hell am I going? Okay, I remember I came from here, but... Oh, what? Why can't I leave?
What the fuck is going on, man? Just let me leave. This game. What the? F Firstly, why is this cave so dark? Secondly, what the freak is going on? Okay, so it says apparently my fighters will all disappear uh, once I switch bodies, so I'm gonna remove my fighters from their posts. Well, it's just. Uh, I'll do this again. to read yet, yeah, so you have to talk to him over and over again, I guess. this okay and then I'm just gonna stand here now you're ready I'm allowing you to leave the crypt and what will happen to my body and no need to worry about your body I find it quite unsavory to be honest it will be here when you return now you may go fine I'll do as you say, but be careful with me. He's using a tenet and uh, what pistol? Whatever. Now we can leave. Ah, there we go. Yes, skeletons is our soldiers, and we're going to kill the nearby town. By my foot, I will Julian every stinking, f stinking frog eater on this godforsaken island. My skeletons are not immortal. Surprising. Berserk like is so good because it just allows you to deal so much more damage. Actually, I have the, I have the skulls that he, he requested for, but I'm gonna steal them from the residents. Anyways, because the residence has them, and I don't want to give up my own one. Alright. There are so many of them. Yeah, you can actually die from this.
run. Are you joking? Oh my god. Just... Yeah, this quest just sucks. It's interesting, but it sucks. And now we have to get the fuck out of this shit cave again. I forgot to talk to him. Are you joking? Alright, I guess I will end this episode once I... I'll end this episode here, actually. I'll find my way out of this cave, so thank you guys for watching. Goodbye, everyone.